Hi, Scott Miller, CBSSports.com. In Goodyear, Arizona, with the Cleveland Indians and rising star Matt Laporta. Uh, Matt, you've kind of become one of the, the cover boys, so to speak, in the Indians' rebuilding project. Everybody talks about your bat. Uh, you've been over here now about a year and a half, I guess, from in the CC Sabathia trade. Uh, what are your impressions of Cleveland, and uh, are you ready to hit? Yeah, I'm definitely ready to hit. Uh, Cleveland is, is a great town. I mean, they really love the ball club, and, and the organization's great. A lot of guys starting you know, with the owner and, and Mark Shapiro and Chris Antonetti. I mean, all the way down, guys are just, uh, you know, great people. You're um, transitioning this. Uh, you, you've been outfielder, and I know you were doing a lot of work this spring at first base. How's that going? It's going well right now, uh, getting my feet underneath me over there. Um, you know, learning the game a little more on in the big league side over there, so it's fun. What uh, What's the most difficult thing about first base? Probably uh, learning the plays and get, making sure you're you're at the right position at the right time. I mean, with the outfield, it's you know pretty simple. You just hit your cutoff man, and, and that's about it. Um, now, the catcher Mike Redman was telling me. I guess you were taking ground balls at second base the other day, or something <laughs> like that. Yeah, I took a couple over there. Uh, I don't think I have a future at second no? base. No. <laughs> uh, it sounded like maybe Redmond, a couple of guys might have helped let you know you didn't have a future uh, while you were taking ground balls. Yeah, they uh, they let me know. I mean, you got Woody telling me how bad I was and, and Red, you know, but it was good stuff. Yeah. Uh, also, I know you're coming back from a couple of uh, injuries. You had a, a hip last year and a, a toe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was turf toe, which needed to be repaired surgically. Mm -hmm. And how are you now? I'm getting, you know, close to 100%. Uh, it, it'll take time in the games to finally get to that point where I'm 100%, I think. Um, Matt is a, a University of Florida product, Florida native, and uh, also played in the Beijing Olympics for Team USA, correct? Yep, that's correct. And uh, how did that go? What were the, uh, in, what, what did you think of uh, the game over there? Well, it was amazing to be able to represent, you know, this great country we live in. Um, and it was awesome to see all the different athletes from all over the world and how hard they've practiced and competed over the years to get to this one opportunity. And it, it was really a special event. Did it, uh, I would assume playing in the Olympics there, uh, just kind of helped develop your baseball career further? Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's always fun to get to play overseas somewhere and get to play against uh, different competition and see how different cultures play the game of baseball. What was the coolest thing you did in China? Uh, we got to go see the Great Wall of China, my wife and my mom and my mother-in-law. It was nice. Cool. Did you walk on it? Yeah, we did. We walked yeah. on it for you know an hour and a half or so, and then we took this cool, uh, it was like a sled-type toboggan all the way down to, I guess it's on a mountain, so we took it down the mountain. It was pretty sweet. All right. Um, well, back to Cleveland and uh, uh, Progressive Field. Uh, we'll let Matt go. Scott Miller with Matt Laporta, uh, one of the pieces of the future of the Indians. Uh, with CBSSports.com in Goodyear, Arizona.